Weekdays AFC Divisional in Buffalo, 3 p.m. Cincinnati's Local 12, it is Old Bengals backup Jordan Palmer. He of 11 NFL completions across seven seasons who has used a whip-like mind to become a sort of quarterback whisperer to the elite. He put Bengals quarterback Joe Burrow through his draft prep and still works with him occasionally during the spring and summer while Buffalo's Josh Allen bought a house down the road from him in Southern California in between working out with him. These guys are like trees. They're either going to keep growing or they're dead, Palmer says this week. Some grow at a more rapid pace than others. These two guys have their own styles and have two different approaches to the game, but the one thing you can definitely say is both guys have evolved way ahead of the pace of everybody else. Those guys check every box and they're doing at a young age. They also have a history of being clutch. Then there is Allen, the 6-5, 247-pound 21st century quarterback blueprint whose legs are as dangerous as his arm and that right wing is damn near nuclear. Bengals linebacker Logan Wilson, a Wyoming teammate, once saw him throw at 70 yards in the air standing still. A Bengals defensive coach says Allen is like Chiefs Hall of Fame tight end Travis Kelsey who can throw. Allen has led the Bills in both passing and rushing yards in four of seven career playoff games. Only Steve Young and Russell Wilson have done that more for their teams. Allen has averaged 354 offensive yards per game in the playoffs, most in NFL history by any player with at least five postseason games. He also has a 105 passer rating in the fourth quarter of playoff games, the third highest over the last three decades. They're both getting better, Palmer says. Burrow he believes, has shown the most improvement this season on his velocity and how quickly he is getting rid of it and seeing the field. How efficient he is as a mover and how connected he is, Palmer says. When you become really connected to the ground and you become really effective moving around, it also helps him in terms of increasing velocity. He didn't miss in college, either. He's been playing well for a long time and yet continues to make big improvements. Across the board, Palmer can't make it Sunday. He advises so many quarterbacks at the moment that he almost prefers to watch it on the couch so he can fast forward through the defense.